Hi there, I'm Karen Bailey, demonstrating Buckleboo Shuffle from Jazz and Around Book 6. Now, Buckleboo is a town on the west coast of South Australia, so I thought the, the title couldn't resist it, Buckleboo Shuffle. Uh, so, Shuffle, it's a shuffle rock, I suppose. So, it's written, I've written it in 12 8. So it needs to be counted either 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, or 1 and a, 2 and a, 3 and a, 4 and a. And I think this piece needs some serious counting. It's got some challenges. Um, the first one, perhaps, I'll demonstrate is the left hand. So the good thing about the left hand is once you've learnt the first bar, that pattern continues through, throughout in the three 12 bar blues chords. It's a 12 bar blues. So one and four and five. That covers it. Okay. Now against that we have the right hand, oh, the introduction. There's a little bit of syncopation there which adds to the complexity of the counting. I don't want to put you off, by the way. Um, now, the theme starts at bar five, and it's quite simple, really. That's the bare bones of it. There is a little turn in there, which can be a bit challenging for students, I find. So learn it without the turn first, and then you add those and play those grace notes lightly, not too heavy. That will make life a lot easier. Actually, I've written one out at measure 41, 42. That's a different way of the same, same phrase, actually. So that might help you interpret bars 5 and 7. Now, tricky passage at um, bar 41, triplets in the right hand with the, with the, the left hand pattern in the left. That can be a bit challenging, so that might need a little bit of extra practice. Also, 45. That needs serious counting. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Left hand, one and a, two and a, three and a, four and a. Okay, if you count that carefully, you'll get it. And there's a cliche ending. With a gliss on the end. Now the, sh the shake there, I've written the shorthand version of a shake, so it's that's the chord, thumb, and top three notes. Shake those, left hand is just the two notes involved. And when you add the pedal, you get the full effect of that. Now, I'd written this piece actually before I realised rock and roll and no gliss. So I squashed one in at bar 40. Okay, that's a short, sharp and shiny one. So now I'll attempt to play it.
great fun.